Following up now on a report of a transgender person being attacked in the North Park blocks in downtown Portland. Elise Haas is following this story and has more on its status right now. Elise. Yes, Ken and Jenny. So according to witnesses, the victim and police reports, this assault on a transgender woman happened in public and in broad daylight. So according to court documents, the Multnomah County District Attorney filed a three count charge against Dominic Gonzalez. He's 38 years old and this all investigation started up yesterday and so the victim in this case is a white transgender woman and she and her friend were waiting in line for free coffee and food in the North Park blocks. Both of these women are homeless. According to court documents, that's when Gonzalez walked up to her and started yelling at her and it says he used racist, homophobic and transphobic words. They asked him to leave, but the confrontation escalated and the court documents say he punched her in the face. That's when bystanders stepped in, wrestled Gonzalez away and pinned him to the ground. Witnesses then report chasing after the suspect when he got on a bike and left the scene. Officers, though, arrived in time to see him running and were able to catch up to him and arrest him. So Gonzalez faces two counts of bias crime as well as one count of assault. And the DA's office is trying to better track these sorts of bias crimes when and where they happen. So if you are a victim of a bias crime or a witness to one, then you're asked to call 911 immediately. And if you have been victim of one in the past, then call their non-emergency line. Ken and Jenny, 